This is the voice of JKC. I'm going to be guiding you guys on how QB trading platform works. I'll be focusing on the quantitative trading aspect of QB. The platform has Naira and USD deposit option. They also have Naira and USDT withdrawal option, including other fiat currencies. You can see my withdrawal proof right here. It's important you don't miss any part of this video so you get to understand how the platform works. So guys, before I proceed, I want you all to understand that I'm not a financial advisor. So this video is strictly for educational purpose only and my own perspective on how you can be able to make money online. So with the link in the description below, once you register and you log in, this is how your homepage is going to look like. So if you want to make a recharge on the platform, all you just need to do is click on this recharge button right here. So once you click on the recharge button, you can see the diversified ways which you can make a deposit on this platform. So if you want to make a deposit on this platform using Naira, just click on Naira. Then once you click on Naira, you need to know the exchange rate. So the exchange rate as at the time of making this video was about 1,550, but it later dropped to about 1450 but when making this video it was about 1550 naira okay so now all you just need to do is enter the amount which you want to purchase you enter the amount right here let's say i'm going to purchase a hundred dollar which is 155,000, which is uh, you can see the equivalent value right here you click on transfer to bank then you click on submit once you click on submit to be redirected to the payment page all you just need to do is take note of the account number the bank name and the account name copy it go over to your mobile bank app and make the exact payment so take note if there's a note right here just copy it and paste on the transaction remark while making your payment all right for fast approval so once you've made the payment then you come back to the payment page and click on i have made this bank transfer it's just that simple so if you want to recharge using usd trc20 you can just come right here and click on trc20 once you click on trc20 mind you that the minimum deposit is just ten dollars so just copy the usdt wallet address right here once you copy it then you go over to your wallet app and make the payment so make your deposit in due time and the deposit is automatic so it will arrive automatically on your account so once you've made your deposit do not forget to claim your reward on the reward page there's a registration reward for every user just click on the reward page once you click on the reward page right here you scroll down and you click on claim reward so just claim this reward for first time registration and you can see that i receive about 0.35 usdt right here so now to execute your trade first you will need to have cube all right so cube are trading boards that help you execute a quantitative trade order so you need to purchase them for you to execute your quantitative trade order so click on buy cube to buy one once you click on buy cube right here you can see there are different cubes so the four hour and the 12 hour cube all right if you are going to purchase it make sure that you have a minimum of ten dollar to make your quantitative trade all right so if you want to execute the 24 hours trade you must have at least a hundred dollar for you to make or execute that trade but if you have less than hundred dollar you can execute the 12 hours and the four hours trade all right so mind you i'm also going to be giving free cubes to everyone who join my team okay so now to purchase this i'll click on buy purchasing the 24 hour cube click on confirm right here then i'll need to enter the quantity so i'm buying just one it costs about 0.4 dollar enter my payment password and click on confirm so i've successfully purchased the cube right there now it's time for me to execute the trade order more like your daily tax so to do that just click on this finance right here once you click on finance make sure you switch over to smart not customize just switch over to smart trading which is the quantitative trade and you click on select a cube so i have a cube 24 hour cube right here you select it right if you have less than 100 you select your 12 hour cube then i will need to enter the amount so 
I can be able to trade. I have at least $100. I'll just click on all to enter all of my account. I'll click on select the server. I'll just choose server one. When I choose server one right here. Then I will scroll down and click on create to execute my trading order. All right. So you can see my trade has started right here. So it's going to run for 24 hours because uh, I have a minimum of $100 investments right here. So if you have less than $100, you can just be executing your daily tax or daily trade every 12 hours or 4 hours. Though 12 hours is much more convenient. So now, once you execute your trade, you click on this reward option. There's a reward for first order. So scroll down right here. You can see it right here. Awarded for your first order. I'm going to receive one cube right here for participating or entering a quantitative order. I'll click on claim reward. All right. So I have received 24 hours cube right there. One. I'll scroll down again. I'll click on claim reward for my first recharge. So I've received about 14 cubes right here each, which is 12 hours cycle. So now I'm going to show you how to make a withdrawal on this platform. So just click on this icon, this cube icon right here. So this is your user interface. This is your user interface. Once you click on it, you'll be redirected to the page like this. So once you click on password, this is password where you get to set up your payment password and your login password. And the code, of course, will be sent across to your email. For the KYC, this is where you get to undergo your KYC. KYC is not so important, except you have a uh, trading with a minimum of $300 and above. And once you enter your KYC and it's failing, you can do well to contact the customer service right here and it will be approved immediately. This is the, con the customer service uh, option right here. So now before you withdraw, you will need to set up your wallet address so to do that just click on wallet right here once you click on wallet click on this plus sign right here click on the plus sign if you want to withdraw using naira you need to add up your bank card click on naira once you click on naira right here you need to enter your account name this is the option for your account name once you enter your account name right here then you need to select wallet type once you click on select wallet type you can see the available banks right here which you can use to receive your payment after that you need to enter your new ban and you need to enter your phone number right here once you enter your phone number then you click on send a verification code will be sent across your email you click on submit so if you want to enter your usdt wallet address click on usdt you enter your wallet address right here leave the chain wallet at trc20 then you need to click on send a code will be sent across to your email so just enter the verification code and you click on submit now you are good to make a withdrawal on this platform just simply click on the withdraw button so you can see you have other options which you can use to withdraw if you want to withdraw using naira you choose naira and once you choose naira you need to enter the amount right here in usdt you select your bank card right here then you enter your payment password you click on send a code will be sent across to your email to verify you are the one withdrawing the money then you once you enter the code you click on submit that's how to withdraw using naira if you want to withdraw using usdt 20 you click on it then here you need to enter the amount you choose your wallet type you choose your wallet then right here you enter your payment password you click on send a code will be sent across to your email to verify that you are the one withdrawing money once you paste the code then you click on submit so i withdraw about 12 dollar right here and there's a five percent service charge fee your withdrawal is going to arrive within 30 minutes to two hours according to the platform so i received my payment in due time you can see right here after the five percent service charge fee I receive about 11.4 USDT. So you can get started here with a minimum investment of just $10 or 20,000 Naira for those depositing in Naira and start earning a reasonable amount of Naira or USDT daily on this platform. So guys, if you found my video useful, please do well to like and subscribe. 
turn on the notification bell so whenever i post something new you'll be the first to see it see you guys in the next video